You know, being fortunate enough to race on all the big tracks around the world, this is the only one that I've never driven. So the opportunity to come here today has been just absolutely tremendous. Definitely driving the, the circuit, uh, just very, very special. Uh, you know, to go into turn one, uh, you know, even though we're going backwards, it's still a lot of speed, real fast. You go flying across the yard of bricks. So just a, a special place. You can see a lot of the history. You can see a lot of the attraction, why you want to come here. The test today was phenomenal. We just had a great time here. This track is a historical place. It's been here for over 100 years and it's an opportunity of a lifetime to come here and just get to drive down the front straight away, go through turn one, even if it was backwards, and uh, just enjoy the place. You think of tracks like this, you think of Daytona also, just giant, giant tracks uh, with a lot of history. It's a unique place, you know, you have such such a long straightaway, uh, leaving the infield road course, coming on to the short chute, then going reverse through Indy turn one, all the way down uh, to the first corner of the road course. It's just, I mean, you're on the gas for a long time. Uh, and then you have a, a bunch of slower, tech, more technical corners. So definitely a big compromise uh, setup-wise for the car. Um, you know, and having the opportunity to come test was, was a great opportunity to figure out exactly what, what works around here. So I uh, think the engineers have, have some good data to look at, and uh, we hopefully can put it to good use in the future. It's been a really good opportunity for us all, not just to come here and look and see what it's all about. We've had some interest from the fan base here already today, but also just to do a proper test and actually see what we need if, uh, you know, with regards to car setup, tires, etc., if we were actually going to come back and, and do an event here. The flow was good. Um, I love the speed, you know, the fact that, I mean, Indianapolis is speed and, and, and need to have that uh, as well. I think they will be able to race wheel to wheel and I think it'll be a bit of drafting down in the turn one. We had a good day here with the Stevenson Motorsports Pontiac GXBR. Uh, just a privilege to be out here and, and excited that uh, the Grand Am and the Speedway invited us out. Uh, we had a good day. We really just worked on the car setup this morning on the F1 circuit and, and just worked our times down and, and got comfortable with the grip. The track rubbered up as we went on, so grip just kind of kept getting better and better. The test was really a lot of fun for us. For me, it was not the first time that I drove here. I was here in 2004 already for, with uh, the Porsche Super Cup. The track changed a little bit, though. There's a new configuration in the back of the track where we used to drive two hairpins and there's now like a right-left combination. But uh, I think everybody came along pretty fast. You know, it's uh, for professional race drivers like the guys that were here at the test today, not a big deal to figure out the track. It's a lot of fun to drive here at Indy. Uh, the tire wear isn't as bad as I expected from watching the Formula 1 cars here. and. Uh, but the loading is a lot on NASCAR 1, but uh, we're getting it sorted out and I think it's a great race track. The track is a really technical track, definitely for the drivers and the engineers. It's really important and uh, to, to set the car up for the long duration corners. And for us uh, as drivers, it's really challenging because there's so many uh, long duration corners that lead into another opposite direction long duration corner. So um, I, I really enjoy driving it. You know, top speed wise, it's, it's a little faster than Daytona. We, we geared very conservatively, so uh, you know the infield is very technical. So a lot of slow speed stuff, a lot of high, high speed stuff. Uh, you need to have good brakes. You need to have good balance. Uh, so here you need to have a little bit of, of everything. That's that's why we ran on the tighter course, which wasn't as demanding on the car or the tires. But I really like the speed. I think this place is all about the speed. So hopefully we get to run the uh, the oval. I thought the track was uh, nice and flowing through the infield. wasn't too tight. Yeah, there's a couple spots where you do have to use a lot of lock and it's slow, but it's a good mix of medium speed and uh, low speed. And then you get up on the oval and really let the car open up and are running it up pretty high speed. So it's a good mix of everything here and uh, your track's very smooth, easy to drive on. It's, um, it's a great facility. The infield, I think, is as good as it can be for an infield road course. This track in particular is cool because you can use the curbs a lot, which is uh, something you can't do at all the tracks we go to. Uh, so that part's good. I think we'd have a fantastic race here. And the track is kind of three different tracks in one. Uh, there's some bumps in some parts and, and very sharp corners. It makes it seem like a bit of a street course. And then you have some very, very smooth, uh, high speed, faster third, fourth gear turns. Uh, and then, of course, you have the, the banking turn, which is very cool. I'm honored to be back here, and, and Indy's it. That's the number one place in lunch course. The track is, uh, is a lot different than I'm used to, but it's, it's a fun track. The oval is very fast, and I, I hope we get to race here. I think it's going to be uh, a great place if we have the opportunity to come and race. Um, pretty successful test all around, and 
you know, just a tremendous facility, and, and we had a bunch of fans show up just for a test day. So I think, uh, I think coming here to race would be an excellent opportunity. You know, we just have to make it a, a special race. There needs to be something different than what we normally run to, uh, to coincide with, with the Speedway itself. But I think definitely we could, we could have a race here. You know, looking forward to hopefully having an event here. Uh, we learned a lot. We learned that this is a place where we could have a great show. And I think, you know, Grand Am could put up a great event here. And hopefully we'll get invited back. It could be a really good sports car race and perhaps one day become one of the top sports car races like with the tradition of uh, Le Mans, Daytona and so many other races, you know, it could be the beginning of that. So, so I think it's a really good initiative, we'll see what, what happens.